Hello, this is Jairo Arriola, AKA Sold by Veteran, your Silicon Valley Realtor. And as the title of this video reads, I'm gonna be going over the three most common myths that I've ran into as a realtor here in the Silicon Valley. Now these three myths are in no particular order, but I just wanna make sure I educate and inform buyers, especially first time home buyers, on what kind of myths there are out there. So that way you guys are educated and can make an informed decision. And when you guys are ready to move forward, then you can reach out to a realtor in your area. If you're in the Silicon Valley, of course, feel free to reach out to me. So these are in no particular order. Here we go. Myth number one. This is a very common myth that I get among first time home buyers or just people in general that want some more information on buying a home. And what people ask me all the time is, hey, Jairo, I have great credit, but my partner doesn't have great credit. They have horrible credit. Can I use my credit and my partner's income to qualify for a home loan? And the simple answer is no. Right now, whoever is going to be on the loan has to have good credit and stable income. If number two, do I need 20% down to buy a home? The answer is no. Right now, you can buy a home sometimes with as little to no money down. There's great down payment assistance programs that help with down payment and closing costs. The most common loan that most first time home buyers use is the FHA loan, which is three and a half percent down. Uh, to qualify for some of these down payment assistance programs, you need at least a 660 credit score. You will be able to qualify for down payment assistance and even closing costs. We've seen clients where they buy homes here in the area, uh, even in Stanislaus, Modesto area, with $2,500, $3,000 out of pocket. Myth number three, I don't need an agent. I will deal directly with the listing agent. This is a very common question that I get from potential first time home buyers and buyers at some of my open houses. Now look, a lot of times a listing agent has a relationship established with their client, the seller. If you go in trying to negotiate and let the listing agent know like, hey, I want to buy this house, can you help me get it? It's gonna be very difficult for the listing agent to negotiate on your behalf to get you a deal. What do I mean by this? What you want as a buyer is buyer representation. You wanna have your own realtor that's gonna negotiate for you to try to get you the best price. You want a buyer's agent that's going to represent you to the fullest. So technically, you don't need a buyer's agent, but it's very, very beneficial for you as a buyer, especially a first time home buyer, to find someone that's gonna be in your corner to help you negotiate a great deal. Once again, these are the top three myths that I've gotten as a realtor here in the Silicon Valley. We'll recap them real quick. Number one is you definitely cannot use other people's credit if you have great income and bad credit to combine to qualify for the loan. Number two, you definitely don't need 20% down to buy a home. There are other loan programs out there. You can go in as low as three and a half percent for down payment. And if you need down payment assistance, then if you have the 660 credit score, you may be able to qualify for down payment assistance and closing costs. Myth number three is I don't need an agent to help me find a home. Technically you don't, but as far as representation, it is in your best interest to find yourself a buyer's agent that'll negotiate on your behalf to get you the best terms and the best price for your home. Thank you guys for checking out this video. You can follow me on all my social media channels at Sold by Veteran on YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook. Feel free to put any questions that you have below, comment below, uh, share these videos so we're able to educate more first time home buyers and buyers in general. That way you have the right information when you're going through the home buying process. And remember, I serve my country honorably. Now let me serve you with all of your real estate needs. Thank you guys, bye-bye.